G'day everyone, Elliot from Access Alarms. I'm just here just coming to show you the new TVT system. So uh, I've had a couple of inquiries of how to download some footage off the TVT system. So as you can see here, I've just logged into one of our systems. It's um, logged in through the autonat.com here. You put in the password that you should have received or the um, serial number that you would have received on the email with um, your username and password. So once you've logged into here, you can see the cameras running live. It does come up down the bottom here when you log in. Um, I will say you must use Internet Explorer. That's this little icon down the bottom here. Make sure you're using this, this Internet Explorer, not Microsoft Edge, not Google Chrome, not Firefox, any of those sorts of things. Just use Internet Explorer. It's guaranteed to work. If you need to get to that, just click here and type in iExplore and it will come up. There it is there. Okay, so iExplore, if you ever need to find it, there it is there. Okay, so moving on. Um, if you want to download footage, you can see here you've got the live display, playback, backup, and function panel. Just go to playback. Okay, um, once that's brought this image up now, Select which one you want to look at. So I might just go and want to look at Harvey Street. Um, let's just look at today, which is the 29th of January. Um, and you hit play and it'll bring the picture up. Okay, so say we see something here at uh, 8 a.m. Okay, so you need to, I've just paused it. You can see here, I want to record all the time between 8 and Let's just do 8.30 because I don't want to download too much footage. Um, try and minimise how much you're downloading. Obviously, the, um, the more you download, the more space it takes up on both your hard drive and also the, your network connection. If you're running one of our SIM card units, just be wary that you are limited to typically a gigabyte of data. So if you start downloading excessive amounts, it will you will end up with a data charge at the end of the month. So how you do the download here is you can see I've got this is your little download or backup button. Okay, so set I'm just going to set eight o'clock. So backup start time. Let's just go eight o'clock. Okay, I want to move this to eight thirty. There you go. You can see the little green arrow there. Eight thirty. Hit the off time there. You can see it comes up red here and pause that and just go download it and just put it in i'm just going to put it in my pick a folder wherever you want um i'm just going to put it to um, just put it on my desktop for now go okay all right and just go okay now it'll start downloading that it'll download it to the computer okay as you can see, even downloading half an hour on the maximum speed that I've got here in the office, it does take quite a lot of time. That's only a 2% for half an hour of footage. So a little, my calculator here, is it gonna give it to me? There we go. I'll work that out right, 1.4 megabytes a second times 60 seconds in a minute times 60 minutes an hour times 24 hours in a day. Yep, how much? So, I'm just gonna pause the video for the moment and I'll get back to you when that's finished downloading. Okay, kicking back off. You can see there that I've now downloaded 100%. Um, I will say as well is I actually encountered an issue while I was downloading. Um, just be wary to check stuff like um, Mike Norton actually flagged and said you can't um, Internet Explorer was trying to do something illegal. So just be careful or check with your IT company if you do have um, strict IT policies on your computer to make sure you can't, can actually do these things. It, it, just if the file's not showing up, it's a good idea. So now I've just downloaded that to, I've just set up a folder on my computer called cameras. Okay, there you go. Sorry, we're not going to use Windows Media Player. I just use VLC Media Player because that works well. Um, your Windows Media Player should play it as well. But this is just standard VLC Media Player. Um, free download, easy enough to play. Um, you can see that that's just straight from the hard drive of my computer, straight here. Open with VLC Media Player. And so that's using your PC. Um, if you want to know how to do it on your phone, just watch the video. Cheers.